My name is Jocelyn Gauthier and I'm the Service Bureau Segment Manager at Ray3D Europe. Um, this is a new segment for us because we would like to help service bureaus to take the best out of their 3D printer farm. Um, they already have uh, very reliable tools thanks to the Ray3D range, but we would like to go beyond the technology and offer direct contact to, to support these companies. So here you can see that we have many printers. This is an actual print form we have set up using uh, ID Maker for the slicing and Race Cloud to manage the machines. And it's a very simple way because we understand these companies need to focus on their customers, not really on the machines. They have to work, they have to generate cash and uh, service bureaus should not worry uh, about the technical part. So this is ID Maker, uh, Ray 3D uh, native slicer, which is the best tool to uh, optimize your usage of Ray 3D machines, but to not, not only because it's open to uh, any uh, other uh, FFF uh, brands. Um, but here I'll make a, a demonstration. It's very simple, very intuitive in the way that when service bureaus have uh, new people coming on board the company, uh, they, uh, they will feel very uh, comfortable with it because we have uh, profiles already. So you load your part, you will just start the slicing and then you have profiles already depending on the material you want to use. So for a beginner, it's very easy. Then you just slice it, it will work. For experts that are maybe willing to uh, go beyond and uh, really do more technical things, they can then of course edit the settings and go very detailed level for each parameter. So it's convenient for beginners and it's very powerful for experts. So once you're done your slicing, which is very fast, then you will be able to uh, have a preview of your work. And with this, you will be able to check if the parameters are set properly and then check Maybe, for example, here the infill, we are going to, uh, to increase it. And then you can review it. Oh, we are lacking some support, so I will close it. And very hard, add very easily uh, auto support. Then it's generated automatically and I'm ready to go. If I want to use um, another filament that is not in the, in the list here, in one click, I can access the open filament uh, profiles, which are brands that are working with uh, Ray3D to certify their uh, filaments. So we have tested uh, each of these filaments. So you can select any brand, for example, here BASF, and then I will be able to download for my machine the settings that are perfectly matching uh, my needs. And then I will slice. And, um, and use it as well, so very easy. One also unique feature that we have with uh, ID Maker is the texture. So you can very easily apply texture to, uh, to an object. So when it will print, instead of being uh, smooth, then it will take the, the image that you have imported and create a smooth texture that you will be able to, uh, to parameter in the slicer. So for example here, then it will create this weird surface. So you can create your own and you can also import different ones from the uh, uh, IT Maker library online in one click. So it's very easy. You have many ideas and people are contributing and sharing their texture uh, on the web. So it's very powerful too. And as well, you have a strong ID Maker community sharing profiles, sharing ideas and solutions. So this is the slicing part and we can also uh, go beyond and when Service Bureau has many uh, printers to manage, they can also do it remotely with uh, Raise Cloud. So with Raise Cloud, you can just click here, log into your system and access uh, all the machines that you have on your network. Could be in the same building or spread around the world. One machine, 10 machines, 100 machines, you can do it from uh, Race Cloud. Thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed that part. If you have any questions on ID Cloud, Race Cloud, or the Race Factory, 
uh, feel free to contact us. And now I will hand over to uh, Emil Janevic, well, which is the uh, CEO and owner of Gagat AM, a um, famous service bureau in the Netherlands. Hello, I'm Emil from Gagat AM. Um, I'm representing the um, Philippine service based in the Netherlands. Uh, for the local uh, companies and we supply parts mainly locally for a um, large amount of uh, industrial, industrial customers. Uh, this starting from automotive to IoT, predictive maintenance companies and oil and gas industries as well. Uh, we're very focused on industrial materials such as uh, PA carbon fiber, PA glass field material, PPGF 30, for example, also TPUs and flexibles. That's also in our portfolio. Uh, Rest 3D allow us to uh, actually have that portfolio within our service provider because they are suitable for that, they are enclosed machines, very reliable, very suitable for mass production and uh, affecting the supply chain locally. Uh, another benefit for us was um, uh, Idea Maker and Race Cloud, which is making a cluster of, of the software where they supply, which is connected very well with the machines. So we can very easily upload parts into our farm and distribute for the 30 machines which we have. And that uh, helps us with efficiency.